Sane Rivi Sangala, aka the Samoan rapper Dei Hamo. And it all started in the small South Auckland suburb of Papa Toy Toy. I actually started experimenting with music when I came to Aurere. I remember writing songs before I'd come to school. I even remember telling a friend of mine that I was going to be a rapper and he said that I would never, I would never make it. So I took that as fuel for me um, to make it even more. Growing up, my parents never understood about me and my fascination with hip hop. I told my moms I'm gonna rap for a living. She say, oh, that's nice. Now, when you gonna take out the rubbish? Damn. Nobody took me serious, but that's cool. My old attitude was fine. I'll show you. My cultural background has never held me back from anything. If more so, it's um, given me more drive. Being a Samoan, we're very passionate people. I find that I've just always been driven to achieve the things that I set my mind to. It was the 1980s that Sunny attended Aurere College, a school that prides itself on cultural diversity. I had a passion for music in school. I love music, um, but I actually failed music when I came to Aurere. That was actually quite frustrating for me because how can I love music but fail? Self-doubt is huge, but I got rid of that by just being confident in my craft of writing music. Riders, come out in 2006, he won not one, but two awards at the Pacific Music Awards, Best Male Artist and Best Urban Artist. So what's next on the agenda for Dehamor? I've actually moved into directing. Uh, I've shot in a few music videos. I'm looking at moving into movies. That's what my next goal is. My advice for any aspiring musician or athlete or whichever field anyone wants to be in is to follow your dream, follow your passion and just go for it.